Hey guys, I'm Kyle with Rhino. This video is about a new mode in our iOS app called Remote Mode. Let me show you how it works. Let's open up the app, connect to our unit called Tripod, open up Remote. All right, it's gonna ask us to calibrate. I'll make sure my brake is off. I have the high-speed motor. All right, we are calibrated. Let me walk you through the menu here. So you have two trackpads, similar to the trackpads you use to set up your keyframes in video or time-lapse mode. Your left trackpad, if you move it left, is going to control your slider. If you move it up and down, it's going to control your focus. The right trackpad is pan and tilt. Now, let me show you how you can customize some of these settings. In the top bar above the trackpads, you'll see a button that says slide focus. If I tap this, I can choose just to make that trackpad slide, just to make it focus or go back to both. The right trackpad is very similar. I can click on pan tilt, I can only do pan, I can only do tilt or I can make it both. Then you also have a sensitivity setting for both of those trackpads if you want them to move faster or slower. Now, one thing that I like to do I can't control four axes at once. It's a lot of things to concentrate on, especially when I'm looking at my shot most of the time. So we can turn on loop in the middle. Let me put loop to medium. There's three different settings for that. Medium is a decent speed for me. Now, one thing that we like to do when we capture a slider shot is that I like to move my pan opposite the direction that my slider is moving. So if I'm sliding right, I am going to try to pan left. It really compounds the movement. One thing you wanna know about remote mode is that the movement is extremely dampened. The sensitivity is a lot lower because you're not setting up keyframes where you want precision. You care about what you see in your actual shot at the end of the day. All right. Let's try to set this up and actually get a cool parallaxing shot. So I'm gonna pan right while my slider is moving left. And as you see, I can get extremely smooth movement with this. Now your Bluetooth range is limited to about 50 feet. Uh, it depends on your con environmental conditions of where you're at. So you can't get super far away, but it's a great tool if you don't wanna use the hardware and you wanna set up a shot without keyframes. If you have any questions about this mode or some of our other app features, watch our other videos, or please feel free to reach out at support at rhinocg.com.